Hello friends, today I'll be talking about the AstroSat, India's first dedicated multi-wavelength space telescope. It was launched on a PSLV XL on 28th September 2015. So let's begin. AstroSat is India's pioneering space observatory, designed to observe the universe in multiple wavelengths of light, from ultraviolet to X-rays. Launched on 20th September 2015 by the Indian Space Research Organization ISRO, AstroSat marked a significant milestone in India's space exploration journey. With the success of this satellite, ISRO has proposed launching AstroSat 2 as a successor for AstroSat. After the success of the satellite born Indian X-ray Astronomy Experiment IXAE, which was launched in 1996, the Indian Space Research Organization approved for the development of a full-fledged astronomy satellite, AstroSat, in 2004. AstroSat is a multi-wavelength astronomy mission on an IRS-class satellite into a near-Earth equatorial orbit. The five instruments on board cover the visible, near-UV, far-UV, soft X-ray and hard X-ray regions of the electromagnetic spectrum. The sanction cost of AstroSat was 177.85 crore rupees. AstroSat was successfully launched on 28 September 2015 from the Satish Dhawan Space Center on board a PSLV XL vehicle at 10 am. AstroSat is a proposal driven general purpose observatory with main scientific focus on simultaneous multi wavelength monitoring of intensity variations in a broad range of cosmic sources, monitoring the X ray sky for new transients, sky surveys in the hard X ray and UV bands. Broadband spectroscopic studies of X-ray binaries, AGN, SNRs, clusters of galaxy and stellar coronae. Studies of periodic and non-periodic variability of X-ray sources. The observatory will also carry out low to moderate resolution spectroscopy over a wide energy band with the primary emphasis on studies of X-ray emitting objects. Timing studies of periodic and aperiodic phenomena in X-ray binaries. Studies of pulsation in X-ray pulsars, quasi-periodic oscillations, flickering, flaring and other variations in X-ray binaries, short and long-term intensity variations in active galactic nuclei, time lag studies in low-slash-hard X-rays and UV-slash-optical radiation, detection and study of X-ray transients. In particular, the mission will train its instruments at active galactic nuclei which are believed to contain supermassive black holes. The AstroSat project is a collaborative effort of many different research institutions. The participants are Indian Space Research Organization, Tata Institute of Fundamental Research Mumbai, Indian Institute of Astrophysics Bangalore, Raman Research Institute Bangalore, Inter-University Center for Astronomy and Astrophysics Pune. Physical Research Laboratory Ahmedabad Baba Atomic Research Center Mumbai SN Bose National Center for Basic Sciences Kolkata Presidency University Kolkata Canadian Space Agency and last but not least University of Leicester Here is the timeline of the mission 29 September 2020 the satellite completed its mission life of 5 years and will continue to remain operational for many years 28 September 2018 The satellite has completed 3 years since its launch on 2015. It has observed over 750 sources and resulted in close to 100 publications in peer-reviewed journals. 15 April 2016 The satellite has completed its performance verification and started its operations. 28 September 2015 AstroSat has been successfully launched into orbit. 10 August 2015 All tests passed. 10th August 2015, pre-shipment review successfully completed. May 2015, the integration of AstroSat is complete and final tests are underway. May 2015, ISRO issued a press release stating that the satellite is planned to be launched during the second half of 2015 by PSLV C-34 towards 650km near equatorial orbit around the Earth. 24 July 2015, thermal vac completed. 24 July 2015, solar panels attached. 24 July 2015 Start of Vinyl Vibration Tests April 2009 Scientists from Tata Institute of Fundamental Research TIFR have completed the development phase of complex science payloads and have begun integrating them before delivery of the 1650 kg satellite AstroSat April 2009 
The challenges in the design of payloads and attitude control system have been overcome and in a recent review committee meeting, it was decided that the delivery of the payload to the ISRO satellite center will begin from the middle of 2009 and continue until early 2010 to enable the launch of AstroSat in 2010 using ISRO Workhouse PSLV C-34. A gamma ray burst was detected by AstroSat on 5th January 2017. There was a confusion whether this event was related to the gravitational wave signal detected by LIGO from the black hole merger event GW170104 on 4 January 2017. AstroSat helped in distinguish between these two events. The gamma ray burst from 4 January 2017 was identified as a distinct supernova explosion that would form a black hole. Astrosat also captured the rare phenomena of a 6 billion year old small star or blue straggler feeding off and sucking out the mass and energy of a bigger companion star. In 2019, a documentary titled Indian Space Dreams on the Development Journey of Astrosat and directed by Suez Sudbury was released. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment and share this video. And if you have not done it already, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thank you.